Hello everyone, welcome back. And I uh, hope you guys are enjoying your battle of the songs. And I'll give my second round of results here in just a moment. First, let's look at our reading notation. Make sure we keep going with reading notation. Go ahead and spend a few seconds either practicing ta and titi or practicing the traditional counting. All right, go ahead and practice. Okay, I'm going to start with the TT Ta version first. And as usual, if you need to hit pause for a moment, go ahead. And when you're ready, hit play. This one is the K through two, maybe K through three part. One, two, here we go. Tick a tick a ta, long ta, ta, TT Ta, longest ta, ah, TT Ta. Ticka ticka ta. Hopefully that went pretty well and it's getting easier and easier for you. All right, next up, this is part of third grade and definitely all of four through six. Traditional counting. One, two, everybody go. One e and a two, three, four. Two, three, and four. One, two, three, four. One and two, three and a four. Hopefully that went pretty well for you. Review if you need to. So on the last battle of the songs, we were looking at duets. The first round was the solos, and then the second round battle of the songs was duets. And we had two songs. We had Can You Feel the Love Tonight and The Pirates of the Caribbean. Both of them were great songs. Once again, lots of votes. And thank you to those of you that are remembering to tell me why. Remember, my assignment is two part. You have to tell me, one, your song, and two, sorry, make sure that it's in there. Two, you have to tell me why you chose it, okay? I really want to know why it is that you chose the song that you chose. So with that said, I counted the votes up. And there is a difference of 18 points between the winner and second place. Like I said, both were great songs. I didn't know which way it was going to go. But the winner of round two is, drumroll, Pirates of the Caribbean. So if you like that one, great. If you voted for that one, that is wonderful. And uh, if you voted for the other one, that's great too. They were wonderful, wonderful songs. Well, that was duets. So we've gone from solo to duet, and now we're gonna go to a quartet. A quartet is a group of four. Now this time, it's gonna sound different. We're gonna use different instruments too. I like just to keep changing it up on you guys a little bit. So we're going to have four instruments playing in both of the songs because this week or this particular one is quartets. There will be two links in the description, link to song one, you'll have to just click to find out what they are, and link to song two. I purposely don't say on here because I want you to read the description and give me the answer. So please remember to go to the description at this point Click on each link, watch them both, and remember one, tell me which one that you like the best. And then two, don't forget to tell me why. I wanna know why you like that one. I really hope you like our last round for now. I've had some people asking me maybe doing it again towards the end of the year, so that may or may not happen. But our last round for now of Battle of the Songs. As always, ready, set, Go. 